Bayağıdır Dünya Kupası maçını takip ediyordum ve bir gün telefon çaldı. Dedi ki yarı finale gelmek ister misin? Ya yani annemi aradım, babamı aradım, akrabalarımı aradım. Yarı finale gidiyorum. Nervous, actually. I think he's gonna go in. This will be a goal, mate. Don't worry. And then. In the end, everything was okay. They lost, but it was still a great goal. <laughs> kind of like science fiction where you're in Moscow and you look through the gate and you see live footage of another gate in Doha. Having been to Moscow to see the semi-final, it's been really cool to come back to Doha because now they're really starting to gear up for 2022. All of these superimposed versions of the stadiums that are obviously being built right now, it's already happened. Muazzam yemekleri vardı. Spicy stuff. You've got your hummus. In. You've got everything. Vegetarians, don't worry about it. Honestly, honestly, think maybe it was the nicest food I've ever had. Final maçını izlemek için Les Men tüm Katarlılar toplanmıştı oraya. Gerçekten inanılmaz heyecanlı bir yerdi. Yani kendimi Les Men stattaymışım gibi hissetmiştim. watching in their fan zone and knowing that the next World Cup match is ever going to be played is going to be played right here. It's really exciting. <laughs> I also want to say a massive thank you to the Supreme Committee for Delivery and Legacy for having us here, for giving us this amazing experience, having us here in the W Hotel. I want to thank Inflow Summit as well for even thinking of me for this trip. It's been an eye-open experience, it's been an exciting experience, one I'll certainly never forget. And also visit Qatar as well for actually hosting us here for so long in Qatar and giving us the most unique Qatari experience we could get. Mm -hmm.